long time no see i know i've been gone for two weeks um but honestly y'all i just needed a break it was definitely unexpected because i was supposed to have my birthday video up and the becca video up which i filmed the becca video and i filmed my birthday video but my birthday video did not come out how i wanted it to but yeah right now i just blew out my hair because i'm about to get a sew-in i haven't had a sew-in in so long and honestly i've missed it i'm putting this frisbee gone stuff in my hair and this is the same bottle that i had from like a year ago when i did my kinky curly to straight routine i think i used it in that video i use it in some videos but i'm still using the same thing majority of my hair is not going to be exposed i'm just going to have a middle part and that's all that's going to be exposed really but i just want to make sure everything is like good and i'm trying to figure out if i should like oil my scalp or maybe i should just tell her to oil my scalp when she finishes my braid down yeah that's probably what i'm going to do um, i don't think my hair has gotten any longer at all um because i did cut like an inch or two off a couple months ago so it kind of like grew back um and then i just clipped my ends again a month ago i want to straighten my roots but i didn't clean this straightener out i don't know if i want to put this on my edges um i know i said this was trash on my instagram live but i went back to the beauty supply store and she just basically showed me how to use it properly so now i know how to use it i was just like combing through my edges like this like it was supposed to do something she was like no you gotta grip your edges and pull it through just like a straightener comb i was like oh got you so let me straighten out my edges a little bit i don't know if i want to just wrap my hair and go to her house or just put it up in a ponytail don't mind my background my room is really dirty right now i need a bow i'm just gonna just wrap it so it doesn't frizz out before i get a sewing what y'all think uh, can y'all see me i hope y'all can see me i still have my <laughs> y'all don't come for me my christmas tree is still up at this point, it's like a lamp, which is why I haven't taken it down yet. But how have you guys been? How was your new year? Mine is going. I've just been at work. Taking a mental break from like filming beauty videos. But I'm coming back. Um, I'm gonna go back in with the NARS foundation because it's a little bit lighter. And I like that highlighted look. So we're taking that back up under there. Y'all, I want to try a new um, powder for my under eyes. But I don't know which one to try. I feel like the Sasha Buttercup one, um, depending on what foundation I use, it's a little dry. And I don't like my under eyes to look dry. I have a little bit of the Fenty Match Stick on this brush, so I'm just putting the excess on my face. Oh my gosh, this is a 20 minute clip. Ah, I'm gonna have to cut this down. I'm eating oatmeal right now, but I forgot to show y'all the hair. Like, what the heck? <laughs> so I'm using Julia, Ju yeah, Julia hair, and I have the Brazilian, no. I can't remember. I think it's Malaysian curly or Malaysian deep curly or something like that. But I got the inches 16, 18, and 20. Three bundles. And then I got a closure. But I'm not going to use the closure. I was thinking about using the closure. But every time I think I'm going to do a closure, I never end up doing the closure. Because I just like the way my hairline looks. And it just looks more natural when I use my own hairline. So, I got this Malaysian curly. And the reason why I got it curly is because when my hair frizzes up, I want my hair to still match my bundles. So, I got curly. So, hopefully this hair straightens out good because I'm not going to be wearing it curly 
I'm wearing it straight. So this is the curl pattern. All right, so I'm about to put some clothes on and I will see you guys when I am getting my hair done. All right, y'all, so I'm on the way to go get my hair done and y'all, I was supposed to be at work today and I totally did not have it on my schedule because if it was on my schedule, I would have been at work. But it wasn't on my schedule and I feel so bad because like, they, like <laughs> they might need help and I don't know what time I'm gonna get done with my hair in order to like try to make my ship yeah see this is why I'm gonna go back to using my planner because using my phone well it's not even my phone I just need to like double check what I'm doing um, but I don't remember seeing that day on my schedule because I used this schedule that was at work so I just logged the schedule into my phone I just put it in like individually and I checked over myself like a good three times because I did it while I was at work with Chessie. No, I came to work to find out my schedule and um, I didn't have my printed version yet. So I guess, I don't know. I don't know how the heck. Uh. Um, let me get off of this phone so I can see where I'm going. I think she lives in San Francisco. I'm not sure. So let me make sure I'm going in the right direction and I will uh, talk to you guys when I get in there to get my hair done, okay? Okay. Alright, y'all, I'm trying to show y'all the breakdown. Um, I'm gonna put the net on to make sure um, nothing comes out. Oh, a net. Oh. What does the net do? Um, the net is... It kind of fills in any gaps. So like how it just stays in between here. Um, if I was to put the net on, I could sew in that space without the braids in there. Um, and then, depending on what kind of foundation you do, it creates a sturdier foundation. day after I got not day after but the morning after I got my hair done and don't mind it now but I love how my sewing looks the only thing about the hair that I didn't really like is that it doesn't get pin straight so yeah I just twisted it up last night and this is how it looks but I'm gonna do it in another video because I want to have it like flipped away from my face if that makes sense and some like flat iron curls that's probably what I'm going to do um so today on the agenda I have to go get these nails taken off because I'm not about to film with my hands looking like this so I'm about to go get them taken off where I get my toes done and then I need to get gas okay so I'm back a couple days later basically I'm coming to you guys in the future I'm about to film and I just straightened the hair back out and you guys can kind of see like what I'm talking about that it doesn't get like pin straight and even when I straighten it out it starts to curl back up another thing that I noticed about this hair is that it is flowy but it does shed um like when I comb it it's not excessive but the hair does shed a little bit I think that's all I had to tell you guys about like I said I'm about to film so I might end up curling this hair um again I just wanted to show you guys how it looks when it's you know straightened out because the last clip that you guys saw of this hair it was wavy not straightened so well it was straightened and then I twisted up yeah so yeah this is how the hair looks straightened out I like it I haven't really been getting any knots um the only thing that I'm kind of concerned about a little bit is the shedding that it does when I comb it and um I think that's it um I did want it to get more straight and stay straight but this is a curly bundle, so, mm, you know, you to each his own. It does look really realistic. It blends with my natural hair really good, which is what I wanted it to do. I'll probably see you guys later on today, and then I'll end off this vlog, okay? Okay. All right, so, hey, y'all. It's the end of the night, and, well, it's really not the end of the night. It's 5.39, but I feel like I'm not going to close off this vlog because I'm about to go out and take night pictures. Um, but right now I need 
to close out this vlog honestly but right now what i'm doing is looking at my email so i can add the rest of these links to my description box of this sponsored video so i can make it live for y'all um so yeah they just emailed me back the video is approved yes yeah. <laughs> okay y'all so i'm gonna go ahead and finish off what i'm doing right now because i want to make this video live at six o'clock and it's now five five is probably about to be six so this is the hair i'm loving it right now it's looking real good um i did some beachy curls so it can have like I wanted the ends to be straight and still curled, if that makes sense. But I didn't feel like putting a lot of heat on my real hair. So I just tried to like finesse the style. I don't know. Hopefully it looks good. But yeah, this is the hair. I'm loving the hair. If you guys are interested in the hair, how many times can I say hair? <laughs> I'll link it down below in my description box. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching my videos and always supporting me and shout out to julia hair for sponsoring this hair vlog thank you for watching again and i will see you guys in my next video bye